Hey guys, welcome to episode 9 and we're just outside Professor Fig's office with that golden icon for a story quest and you never know what happens with these story quests so it's always good to make a solid save just in case and here Rebellion. we go Solar protection goggles This looks snazzy. Yeah, yeah. Where was? Okay, that's. Rebellion. Nothing else. I'll just wait. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade, with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me, and he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well, but... If our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit, before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? <laughs> Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Smart man. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Accio! Lumos! Levioso! Repero! Accio! Lumos! Protego! Revelio! Revelio.
Hmm. Rebellion. Off on another adventure, are we? Nice. <coughs> I wonder why Madam could die. Hey, shit. Yeah, when I hear that that uh, buzzing sound with the feathers, that's a flying key. So that's how we get these uh, things open. Rebellion. All right. Profess. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell, handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Nice. Sounds uh, versatile. Mm -hmm. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. <laughs> ah. I talk, no, we don't talk about... Hospital wing. Oh boy. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Akio! One. Let me go. Nicely done. Let me go. Akio. That's it. I'd say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. <laughs> That's true. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. This kid. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. 
Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Yes, Nasty. Then let's get to it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were a good girl. Ready huh? to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. There goes my way. Whoa. Whoa. Lumos. Oh, wrong one. Descend on. Let me open. You're better than that. Akio. So don't finish the combo halfway through the cooldown. Bravo! Pull, push, lift. Nice. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really <laughs> have it, it in bitches. for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Assignment's all finished. Revelio. Akio. Revelio. Akio. Hmm. How did I go up though? I see a key up there, hey. Revelio. Too well. And you know I like a good cauldron cake. Rascals, going without me. I had mentioned. Oh, that's even worse. I found you out. It was a spontaneous outing. We had intended to study, but then I really fancied something sweet. And did you go to Steep, please? Yes, and to see Serona. Scoundrels, both of you. I shall remember this next time you ask me about Clabbits. <laughs> Monster. And Chiz Purples. You're on your own with Howen now. Oh, we did get you a cauldron cake. Well, why didn't you say that in the first place? Consider the matter closed and all is forgiven. That is a very long, posh, and English way of saying I don't friend you and I friend you again. <laughs> Revelio. Perhaps I'll come back to this. Oh. Wrong one. 
Keep choosing the wrong um, waypoint, I think. There should be a closer one, maybe. I but trust anyway. Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say, I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's <laughs> to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. Incendio. Getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. Cool down. Accio. Incendio. Leviosa. Accio. Incendio. Setting things ablaze is certainly cathartic, isn't it? <laughs> this lady knows what's what. Revelio. Nice. What are you up to now? Incendio. <laughs> oh, shot range is shot range. I wonder if you might be able to help me with a small, uh, project. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. I suppose it must seem that way. I'm not sure it's justified. It's often been a matter of circumstance. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a... a puff scheme.
Well, they seem innocent, but their tongues can be most disturbing. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I wish more of our fellow students agreed with you. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me Puff Skeen Dunkeen. I'm sorry to hear that. Words can be cruel. Thank you. Poppy keeps offering to help me in overcoming my fear, but I'm too afraid to take her up on it. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. <laughs> <clears throat> Rumor has it that the herbology professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. What sort of plants should I expect in the hidden herbology corridor? I haven't a clue. But have you seen the kinds of plants Professor Garlic grows? If the previous professor was anything like her, I'd imagine they're not exactly harmless. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your mm -hmm. debt. Hmm. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Sounds intriguing. Rebellion! Could you remind me how the... When you spot... I hope you follow some. Oh, this is nice. What's this? Incendio. <laughs> Rebellio. Life seems rather dull and hmm. I should like to retire to a small family, my mother. One just like Brock Gora. I prefer to study in the library. <sighs> Human transfiguration is dangerous. Charlotte Morrison had to go to the Where did that key go? Revelio. That's it. Hell yeah. It's great to do a revelio and not hear the chiming. What's up, boys? Revelio. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Chunky flying boy. <laughs> Cute. Rebellion. Maybe I should say, <laughs> in case I die from some plants. Okay. 
Okay. Revelio. Incendio. Lumos. Accio. Levioso. Rebellio. Accio. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Rebellio. My arm has squares are from Sigmund Fudge. What? She wouldn't make it up. She says they're ones he didn't put in the book of potions. Like some powerful stuff. Incendio. Revelio. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming king. This to like change the day night cycle. Revelio. Incendio. This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Revelio. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. Lumos. Okay, at least my life uh, regenerates outside of combat. Not so bad. Incendio! <laughs> Revelio! Lumos! <laughs> Revelio! Lumos! Accio! Lumos! Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Hmm. Do we get up there? Uh. 
Revelio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Accio. Lumos. Seems the devil's snare was protecting a chest of some kind. Yeah. Now it's mine. Revelio. Lumos. Incendio. Rebellion. Incendio. Lumos. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. Mm. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. <laughs> Steampunk match. Revelio. Lumos. Lumos. Hmm. That's nice. Revelio. Incendio. Oh, so strong. Del scarf. Hopefully, I, I can unlock that and Revelio. get some more stats going. You know. Ooh, a piece of a lot of. Uh... Where am I now? Get that fast quick travel point. <laughs> and there you go. How nice to see you, my young friend. Revelio. Oh, 
here. Looks like there might be some items here. So I was here just now. Let's see. Is nothing here. Okay, so this is where I grabbed the chest. Uh, lovely. More rewards. Rebellion. Mm, okay. I want to go this stuff back for a while first. Looks like it could be worth exploring. I can't, Rebellion. Use, I can't use my one when I'm in the water. Now, oh, where does this lead to? Okay, all right, right. Oh, we've had this before. Have you found anything to, uh, prove my bravery yet? Hello, Duncan. I have the proof you wanted. That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. It's even more than I expected. I knew you were the one to ask. I appreciate you getting it for me. Of course. I hope this helps you prove yourself. This is sure to put an end to Puffskin Dunkin' for good when I show everyone in the common room tonight. Hope this so, will show ever how ridiculous that nickname was. Thank you again, and have a good day. I know I will. Thank you for all of your help. No more puff skiing dunking for me.
Okay, let's see what Professor Fig has for us. There you are. I wonder if I can adjust my field of view because it does feel a bit uh, tight. This looks a bit strange. Maybe I'll put my field of view. Okay, slightly better. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Heckard. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig! I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. Hmm. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. He's fun at parties. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious <laughs> headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Revelio. Wait, now I got this. Incendio. Incendio. Oh, I died. It's kind of short range. Right? Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Perhaps he will. Incendium. Accio. Lumos. Levioso. Incendium. Revelio. Incendium. Really mastered that one, haven't you? Incendium. Levioso. Accio. Lumos.
On another adventure, are we? Rebellion. Incendio. Accio. Levioso. Lumos. Incendio. Mm. Rebellion. Bit too far. Hmm. Let me try it one last time just to be sure. Yeah. Repair it. Oh, not that neither. Well. A new mechanic. Oh, yeah, every time I talk to Sebastian, there's always Rebellion. trouble. Huh? So I better save here, and uh, we'll probably see you in the next video. Ciao, guys. <laughs>